Hey guys, welcome back to my channel, and today we are going to start playing Cook, Serve, Delicious. And not only are we going to be playing it, we're going to be doing a challenge with my lovely and talented friend, Sims3 Symbiote, also known as April. There's going to be links to her channel and her video everywhere. Make sure you check it out. Um, basically, we both bought almost the same games during the Seam sale over the holidays, and we thought it would be fun to kind of do this one together and uh, see who does better and laugh at each other's misfortunes because what else are friends for, really? So that's what we're going to be doing. Um, we're going to try to release these around the same time. I got behind because I haven't been feeling very good this week. So yeah, we're going to be challenging back and forth to see who does better. Challenge accepted. Let's go. Um, I did quick just do day one to kind of get my volume set up, which is good for you guys because otherwise you would have been deafened by the deafening sound of cooking. Alright, um, also note I really love these games, like I love, love, love these type of games, so I get really excited. Okay, welcome to Sherry Soda Tower. This historical building was once home to a luxurious cook served delicious restaurant, but has since been in disrepair along with the rest of the tower. However, the recent economy boom has filled this tower to capacity, and the owners of the tower would like to reopen the cook served delicious restaurant and put you at the helm. You'll need to take this now zero star cafe and turn it into a five star world class restaurant, but first we'll need to very quickly learn the basics. Let's cook. I don't know. Alright, so this is basically just going to be a tutorial day, but that's fine. Alright, this is your main restaurant serving area. It doesn't look the best, but hey, you'll fix it up in no time. You can press the bottom right pause button or hit escape to pause the game at any time during the day. Okay, to the left is your prep station. You start with four, but earn more as you gain stars for your restaurant. You can take orders and serve food from here, so let's give it a try. This is a customer ticket. Press the number one. Okay, so he wants ketchup. Enter. Wow, fascinating. Great job. Three different types of satisfaction levels. Perfect, no mistakes, customer is happy and will come back. Average, customer isn't happy, mistakes are made, might not come back. And bad, customer is angry, doesn't pay, lots of mistakes, won't come back. So I'm going to go ahead and say we want the yellow smiles and occasionally the green unsure about their life faces. And that's my guess. All right, you can also use your mouse to complete orders. Well, what's the fun in that? Just mustard. Fine. Great job. You just learned how to serve a customer. Now let's try a more complex food that requires you to cook it. Ooh. Burger. Meat. Enter. So we cook it. Uh, we need to wait a few seconds to it to grill at the right temperature. Once it turns blue, it's ready to be prepped. Okay. So we want the original meat, lettuce, bacon, cheese, tomatoes. Where's the tea? I think I got it all. Enter. Woo! Great work. You've just completed a more advanced order. Okay. Great. There are two types of orders that you'll find in Cook, Serve, Delicious. When an order is highlighted in blue after cooking, it will require additional prep work. When an order is highlighted yellow, it requires no more prep and is ready to be served. Okay. You can only repair one order at a time, however you can serve yellow cooked serve orders to customers immediately when repairing a different order. Okay. <clears throat> Great. Alright. Customers won't wait around forever to have their food order taken. You'll notice that this food is slowly disappearing from the screen. If it goes away completely, the customer will leave angrily and cause bad buzz for your restaurant. Great. There are chores to contend with, but that's enough tutorials for now. You can always select practice chores in the tutorials menu to try out all the chores you'll need to complete daily. Pfft. We don't need tutorials. Let's do this. Alright, with that you've learned the basics of cooking. Great job. Blah, blah, blah. Let's do stuff. What is this? This is your managing menu. From here you can control your food menu, buy new items, and a whole lot more. You'll work from 9am to 10pm. Then between each day, come here and plan out your business. Great. First, we need to buy some food. You have a starting budget that should allow you to purchase three to five foods out of the 20 offered, okay? Um, a few pieces of foods require equipment. Uh, the stove, grill, deep fire, okay. 
On the left of any food are a series of boosters and detractors. These are elements of the food that can help your business as well as hurt. Okay. Up, up, da. Buzz is vital to keeping customers, and if your buzz is at 20%, customers will slowly trickle in. Alright. Perfect orders gain buzz, average add none. Alright. We can do this. Once you've bought foods, you'll need to add them to the active menu. You can serve up to six different foods at a time. Your customers are all tenants, so they crave new foods constantly. You'll need to add and remove food in the one in huh, add and remove food in the menu every two days to keep them fresh, unless the food has a staple booster, which allows them to be fresh constantly. As indicated with the green icon in the soda soup salad icons above. What? Oh, okay, I see. And those are the basics. Once new opportunities open up. Okay. Welcome to the Sherry Soda email client. This is a quick guide to using the service. New mail. Okay. I know how to use the mail. Good luck on your opening day. Oh, well, thank you. Drop by the Iron Chef studio time. I love Iron Chef. All right, so I guess first thing we need to do is go to your active menu. Please purchase, oh, okay, we need to buy foods first. So let's do corn dog, $250, $4 menu price, not upgradable. Okay. Let's go back. Um, I think we definitely want a cold beer. Who doesn't want a cold beer? All right, so we've got a beer. Um, what goes good with beer? Let's do. Oh, we can't do a burger. Um, let's do a pizza purchase. So we've got beer, pizza, and let's do salads for those people who maybe are a little bit more picky about their food. So we are not going to practice these because we are professionals. All right. So we've got our three foods, your active menu. Let's do beer, salad, pizza. Yay! Back to main menu. Alright guys, I think we are ready to start our day. I have no idea how this is going to go because I haven't actually really played this much besides the tutorial that I just played. So, let's do it. We are going to pwn this game. Begin! Oh, I'm kind of scared. One. Uh, the big salad. Cheese, green, and carrots. Cheese. Uh, greens. We have greens. Greens and carrots. Enter. Whew. Terrified. Pizza. He wants tomato sauce, cheese, pepperoni, sausage, and a sausage. Beef or bacon. Um. Enter. Oh no! 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 Wrong button! Tomato sauce, cheese, olives. Wait. Tomato sauce, cheese. Olives, onions, enter. Oh my god, this is terrifying. We need to flush the toilet and sanitize our hands. Three, no, damn it. Ah. Okay, we're starting over, you guys, because I, uh, I keep hitting the wrong button. Oops. <laughs> Whoopsies. Okay. Try that again. Let's start a new day. I'm getting panicked. Panic is not good. All right. Begin. One. Hold or beer. Enter. Alright. Nice. Who's next? One. Hold or beer. Enter. <laughs> I like this one much better. We're getting a bunch of beer. I know, I'm a cheater. Well, I really didn't cheat. Alright. Salad. Cheese. Onions and peppers. 
Good. Very nice doing business with you, sir. Who's next? Flush the toilet. Sanitize hands. Hold and pour beer, please. Here you go. I'm doing good now. <laughs> One. Alright, he wants cheese, onions, and peppers. Nice. Happy day to you. Goodbye. Anybody? Anybody? Beer. I can do that. I love this. No pizzas. Perfect. Now I kind of feel bad. Do I? I don't know. Rush hour. Oh no. Flush. Sanitize. Beer. Three. Uh, ranch. Cheese. Mushrooms. Tomatoes. Enter. One. Tomato sauce. Cheese. Pepperoni. Enter. Two. Tomato sauce. Cheese. Pepperoni. Bacon. Uh, onions. Enter. Three. One. Uh, tomato sauce, cheese, pepperoni, bacon, onions, enter, two, uh, uh, one, tomato sauce, cheese, enter, three, two, uh, tomato sauce, cheese, olives, ah, uh, olives, onions, enter, one, three, I'm missing the salads, tomato sauce, cheese, pepperoni, bacon, Onions, enter, two. Whew! Oh my god. Alright, we need to flush the toilet. These slobs can't do it themselves. Tomato sauce, cheese, bacon, mushrooms. Uh, hold before the beer. Oh my god. We need a pull bar, set the locks, cheese, sanitize. Three, four, three. Tomato sauce and cheese. Holy cow, you guys! This is intense. And we're only on the first day. This is not good. Alright. Are we done? No. Just the cheese. Alright. This guy just wants cheese on bread. That's intriguing. Two. Tomato sauce, cheese, olives, onions. I need to do the dishes. Alright, he wants ranch, greens, and carrots. Flush the toilet. Ranch, cheese, mushrooms, and tomatoes. Trash. Sanitize hands. Beer. I really like the beer. <laughs> That's easy. Alright. Ranch, cheese, mushroom, tomato. Anybody? We just flushed the toilet. Tomato sauce, cheese, olives, onions. <coughs> okay. Oh, we've got rush hour again. Greens and carrots. Tomato sauce, cheese, sausage, sausage, mushrooms, um, olives, onions. Enter. Two. Beer. Three. Ranch, cheese, bacon, croutons, onions, and peppers. Two. Cheese, greens, and carrots. One. Cheese, greens, and carrots. Four. Ranch, cheese, mushrooms, and tomatoes. Um, three. We really need to flush the toilet. Two. Greens and carrots. Uh, four. Pour the beer. Three. Tomato sauce, cheese, sausage, <laughs> mushrooms, olives, onions. Two. Uh, tomato sauce, cheese, mushrooms, oh no, onions, I did it wrong, two, ah, pour the beer, three, oh god, pull bar, cheese, sanitize, one, 
too. Flush toilet. Holy crap. Ranch. Cheese. Bacon and croutons. Oh my god. I'm gonna be singing that in my sleep. <laughs> Hold to release the beer. Excellent. I don't think we're doing too bad. I wonder how April did. I'll have to check. I know she gets about as flustered as I do, so it's anyone's guess. Flush toilet. Two. Tomato, cheese, olives, onions. Sounds like a good pizza to me. Cheese, beans and carrots. Alright, we need to finish up, take out the trash. Sanitize our hands. Okay, so we served 49 customers. Orders of the day. We had 42 perfect, 1 average, and 6 bad. 13 out of 14 chores completed. No tips. 73 crumbs made. Highest combo was 12. We earned $271. 21% positive buzz. 3% negative. 9 toilets fresh. 2 rats trapped. 6 dishes washed. 10 garbage thrown. And 0 justice dispensed. I have no idea how I did compared to April, but if you've watched her video, you can go ahead and tell me in the comments whether or not I did great or whether or not I sucked. And, uh, yeah, I think one star restaurant checklist have at least 10% positive buzz. Alright, so we need to do all this stuff to get one star restaurant, so we have at least have 10% positive buzz. That's good. Let's check our emails real quick. Beer upgrade available. If you have purchased this item, you can upgrade via the food menu. Okay. More about upgrades. Okay. Um, upgrades allow you to add a new ingredient to your food, and other upgrades increase quality. Every upgrade allows you to charge a higher price in your food. I think that had an attachment. Oops. New item is now available. The tip jar. Can't remember. I went to the cook serve delicious restaurant today or not, so I'm going back if anyone wants to join me. Okay. <clears throat> um, where was that? What is this? Favorite? I don't know. Okay, um... So we're quickly going to buy the tip jar. And let's see. Upgrade our beer. $8 increased menu price. Yeah, let's upgrade our beer. And buy another food. And I think we're just gonna go with the corn dog because it's easy. Um, not during rush hours. Yeah, let's buy it while we still can. And the pretzel. Just buy everything, really. All right. And that, guys, is going to end the first part of Cook, Serve, Delicious. We will pick up next time on day two. And go watch April's video if you haven't yet because, dang it, I said so. Thanks, guys, and I'll see you next time.